since you asked, well, since Slip Space Gaming asked, what genres of game do I think are most criminally neglected today? That was asked during the live Q&A, sir, and I had to take it away and think about it. What's actually underrepresented? What games do I love or what genres do I love that I can't really play anymore in the way that I want to? There's loads that that would apply to, but the more I think about it, um, the more I realize they're not necessarily neglected. They're just not necessarily on all of the platforms that I'd want to play them on. So you can look at things like Japanese RPGs and say, oh, there's, there's not enough of them on Xbox. They're being neglected. But there are Japanese RPGs on other platforms. You can look at real-time strategy games and grand strategy games and say, I want more of those. But there are loads of those on the... Oh, that's not a good start. Hello, everybody. It's Dragon's Dogma today. Um... So step one, it doesn't automatically launch full screen where I can actually see it. Step two, compiling shaders, but the compiling shaders tip, if it has a progress kind of indicator of any sort, it's just off screen, I can't actually see it. So hopefully very fast with the shaders, hopefully. No, got nothing, just compiling shaders, that's all we get. MR, how's it going? Chronic, Tony, Tony, you're not going to watch because you don't want to see the game because of spoilers and stuff. That's reasonable. Don't blame anyone for that. And you're and why are you surprised that I would stream this though? Is it because I didn't stream Final Fantasy VII Rebirth? Chronic, you're not going to watch it because fair enough, fair enough. I would be like much the same. I'm not sure. Um, I'm not sure this is a particularly story-heavy game. Is the only thing that's the the key difference between this and Final Fantasy VII. Final Fantasy VII would be like, well, oh, spoilers everywhere. Whereas this one, yeah, less concerned about it. Any new games? No worries, Tony. Um, do you know what I'll do? I'll play some old games for you. Either you're not able to be here, you'll lose your mini golf. Still compiling shaders. Very awkward. Very awkward. Bum, 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 nah, 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 nah. This game sucks. It's too hard. Is it compiling shaders? Hopefully. Has it crashed? Who knows? Who knows? Is it split awkwardly across two screens at the moment? Yes, yes it is. Oh no, there is, a, there is a progress bar. I can see it now. We're nearly there, if that is a progress bar. How long have I been on the shade? It's not very long, Dodge. Not very long. We're through it now. Probably like a minute or something. Whoa, that's loud. Don't pay for fast travel. Yeah. Radders back on Twitch. Thank you for that. It does boot into a window. I hope it doesn't do it every time. I don't want subtitles. Display language is fine. Everything's good. Problem with HDR calibration is I can't calibrate for everybody that's watching on YouTube's stream. If you're on Twitch, you don't care. You don't have HDR over there. If you're on YouTube, it's an HDR stream. But I typically go with the defaults. <laughs> don't look, everyone. Oh, actually, I think the limit is 41. I just held right on the D-pad until it got to the end. So that's a weird, that's a weird one. Ah, oh, awful start. It's going to make me scroll through the data processing text before the accept button is available. Okay, we're on it. I'm doing it. Oh, you were getting 120 frames per second in pre-rendered cutscenes. Enable network features. Hell yes. I don't want to start the game, Capcom. I want to go to a settings menu. I love a good settings menu. Fortunately, I can. So, oh, it's too loud. It's too loud. So we've got camera, we've got controls, they're all fine. We've got game settings, they're all fine. I haven't seen the game, don't want to understand these kind of things yet. I just want to get my graphics up. <laughs> graphics, full screen. No. Borderless window. Hell yes. 
frame rate, we're going to lock it to YouTube and have some V-Sync. Dynamic resolution, do I want that? Can I have dynamic resolution with quality with DLSS? Nah, that's fine. Low latency, yes. Upscale sharpness default. We're nearly there. Ray tracing, all of it. Of course we're having the ray tracing. Of course we're having the reflections. Of course we're having maximum quality meshes. Of course we're having all of the anisotropic. Anisotropic filtering. Of course we're having all of the... Oh, that's quite low. That's quite a low amount of um, memory use. Oh, it's got a nice little um, visual indicator on the right so you can see what you're changing. Resource intense effects quality. Hell yes, loads of it. Shadow quality, maximum. This is going to kill everything. Shadow cache. Yeah, of course. Contact shadows. Yeah, of course. Motion blur. Controversially, going to keep that on. And the bloom and the depth of field. And even the lens flare, but not the chromatic aberration. Yes, the subsurface scattering. Motion quality, incredibly high. Slim Pickens, they actually let you have all of these settings without a single microtransaction yet. Sound, yeah, I'll have some sound. Headphones, please, for everyone that's watching, but high dynamic range. Perfect. Don't you love a good settings menu? No, no, I freaking don't. I hate settings menus. Some people want settings menus in their PC games. I think those people are wild. Settings menus suck. If you've got a team of developers with professional profiling tools, they can optimize their game. I don't want to. But on PC, that's that's just part and parcel of it. You have to save all of the changes. Game time. Thank you for enjoy like thank you for joining me for my running through settings stream. Keeping motion blur on is controversial, isn't it, Dodge? But it's um it's too broad a setting. If I were playing at really high frame rates, I would definitely turn that off. But Dragon's Dogma 2 is not known for being able to maintain really high frame rates. And if it's going to dip, if I'm going to V-Sync at 30 some of the time, I damn well need that motion blur. Essential. Difference between, like, eyesore and... Oh, for some reason it's got dark. The title screen has a dynamic day-night cycle. Oh, don't look, Tony, it's the story. Hang about? That's I don't speak that. I swear I said give me English. Febramon suffered without a true monarch to guide her and her people. Decades have passed since last His Majesty Erland sat atop the Draken throne. Long have we endured, yet it has not been for naught. At last, the bell has tolled on the age of the Consul. He's right. The bell is told on the age of the console. Of our rightful ruler. The return of the sovereign. <laughs> My word. Such an inspiring visit. Your Majesty shall have my eternal yeah, fealty. No Your Majesty, of how long I have awaited this moment. You can see me, Tony, can't you? Am I not on screen right now? I must be.
before you sit the rightful inheritor of the dragon throne, Steve. chosen by the dragon as its enemy. Behold and rejoice! Fortune has delivered us our savior at last! But I'm already the king. Praise be, for only the sovereign's guidance can lead us true. All hail the sovereign! All hail! Let all present pledge your allegiance to the sovereign. Let us be united in the hope that our legions reign when they are end. Long live the sovereign of Vermont! You can see, I'm so confused. Slay the dragon. If thou seekest to behold this world in its true aspect, abandon thy reason. Cast aside thine arms and thy life both. I ask thee to demonstrate thy will, for naught but thine ambition can alter the course of the rivers of fate. Listen, I missed the pivotal moments of the cutscene because I was trying to figure out why my camera wasn't working, so... That sucks. Am I the king or am I a prisoner? What's happening? Oh, is it? So which one of you was it? No need to be shy. I've just got to take down a record of your name and face. Come on, step forward. I can either select so preset or use it. I did this. I did the character creator. Where's the? Is it you? No. So these are obviously the presets. If the pawn I'm looking for doesn't come, for... are you the one then? Aha! Uh -huh. I thought I recognised you. Yes, that's definitely me. <laughs> Sorry, it's the Morbo Toad. He's ready. Oh, valiant hero. Plucked vaguely from um, Elden Ring, where I was also Morbo Toad, but this one didn't allow me to be as green, so I made him extra, extra slippery. 20, I didn't say that. Sure. Behave yourself, Tony. That's um that's the hero of this story. <laughs> and yes, I was aiming for like my own likeness. I like that look in your eyes. It is queerly brazen for a pawn. Wait, uh, that's not my pawn. What's going on? A is next, B is next, and the other buttons don't do anything. Most of your kind have eyes blank as a cadaver's. Mayhap it is only natural seeing as how you rise from the dead. There's aught different about you, though. Could it be that you fear death just as we mortals do? Worry not, Vessel. Three days here, and you'll be longing for death's sweet embrace. Come along, you feckless dullards. Me, I'm a feckless dullard. At least I don't have any shoulder pain, dickhead. Alms. Alms for the less fortunate. Would you take pity on me, sir? What brings you here? Why are they all injured? I would fain aid you if you are in need. <laughs> Learn your place, pawn. Pray, do as he says and get in line. Tis for your own good I say this. You do not want to invoke the overseer's wrath. I I kind of do, but 
but okay. I'm learning controls now. You can see why he commented on my eyes. Death comes for me next. I am sure of it. We're not allowed to talk to your mission, sir. That one called me sir. He doesn't realize I'm a prisoner. Can't help me out here. I've not much to offer you, sir, I fear. Yay, they know already. Tony, I've got no idea. So it's, it's trying harder at story than I anticipated. Speak to me another time. I'm on duty. No, I didn't mean like no, no story, but I didn't think it was a cinematic thing. Could be wrong, though. Smart game. Get a move on. Always best to start playing in the hole before exploring anywhere else. I'd hasten home were this not my duty. I've no time for you now. Leave me be. Here we go. This big story, you learn about the trees that were chopped down to build the scaffolding. Okay, fair enough. Most games start at an excavation site. I would like to run, Tony, but that's not an option yet. It's not told me the button. There probably is one. Let me press some things. Do your injuries mm -hmm. Pray. Do not overexert yourself. That's nice. Thanks, guy. This is no place for one of your ilk. Tis harsh beyond measure. Even we pawns are pushed to the brink. Okay. You ought not anger the overseer. Let us proceed to the site. So I am a pawn or I'm not a pawn. Now I can jog. Not I can do but wait for death to claim me. So these guys aren't immortal like I'm immortal, and yet they're concerned for my well being. Hmm. I do not understand how it is they compel us. There is no arisen among the overseers. <laughs> See you later, guy. I don't obey that random person. Go where I want. Got total freedom here. Oh, and there's, there's not much in the way of fall damage. I, I have. Possibly gone too far into the hole. I'm not sure there's any way out. <laughs> That's the end of the Morbo Toads adventures. Now he can climb. We're getting somewhere. Damn it, game. Why did you give me freedom? I've got too much light glaring on the screen and I can't actually see a thing. There's a rope here. Can I climb this? Climb the rope. Climb the rope. Oh no, I can't climb the rope. It's alright, this is fine, I can get up here. My shift's over, but no sign of my replacement. Speak to me another time. I'm on duty. See how I tower over her. Fear the Morbo Toad. Would be unwise to disobey. The overseer will show you no mercy. Mm -hmm. I like this game already. Speak to me another time. I'm on duty. It's weird that none of them speak to each other at all. Like complete silence unless I go and interact with them. Ah, freedom! So far the game looks really nice. For what it is. Freedom! What's the jump button? Oh, 
Oh, he's, he's done it. He's off. No full damage, right? Wait a minute. What was that? Huh. Your wife told you your character looks like Lady Gaga. What were you going for, Patrick, when you tried? That's the brine. Yeah, no full damage, but definitely a very aggressive sea urchin. Well, I mean, I got back up somehow to the top of the cliff, so it all worked out just fine. When do I get my pawn? That I made in the character creator. Yeah, I didn't play the first one. The rhyme, the brine. Okay. I guess I'm going to follow this guy for now because the sea urchin insists. Got anything to spare? Accursed vessels. They've the eyes of the dead. Hmm. We needn't chain them up. Thanks for that. Time for you to get to work. Hey. Pick up a boulder. Like a big boulder, or will this one do? This one won't do. Okay, quest markers. This is the same old story for me. And you? Yeah. You are prepared to work. Then you all begin by carrying stones out from the station in the back and bringing them here. Excellent. That's my favorite kind of game. How do you pick stuff up? Pick it up. Game's too hard. Patrick, how do I pick up boulders? Now, oh, whatever. I'd grab your boulder. If there is all you would know, pray ask one of the other pawns. Oh, I got to get them from out here. Hit Planton, I guess, is all right. Let's see if I can get my next death by rolling a boulder down the steps. If there is all you would know, pray ask. Ah, uh, strong. It's the right trigger. I've got it. It just wouldn't let me pick up the first boulder because I hadn't got that far in the game yet. Hiya! Oh. How do I throw it? Yeah. Oh, good overseeing quest guy. Well done. Way to stand there. Boulder Chuck. Oh. Now the next step is to. It's not smooth the way it transitions into things happening. Perhaps we ought to investigate. I wonder actually. So I'm going to investigate in a second. I'm going to have a quick check in the settings because I would. My character's funny. I'd very much like it to smoothly roll through the conversations rather than prompt me to press B all the time. Or A. So, controls, fine. Game settings, auto sheath, prioritize stuff, interface, pawn commands auto, dialogue, quest messages, location names. How do I skip through conversations? That's what I want to do. Aiming stuff, tutorial messages. I don't see such an option. I don't think there is such an option. Weird. Weird choice. 
interesting. Just throw an NPC about 100 foot. Oh, I can't throw anything yet, but I'm not strong. This character is being the stealthy gent that I am, a natural born thief. That's my moment. I'm armed. I'm dangerous. Why am I looking straight at her? Carve. Yeah. Look at these guys. I want to walk the tail. I'm on it. Ah. Uh. Oh, I've got no idea what's happening. Look, I've stabbed it. Hey, yeah. Just keep stabbing the butt. It will die eventually. Oh, I love it. This is so good. Throw them with the right bumper. I can throw things. I don't like throwing stuff. That was a bit shit. Twin fangs. Jump on the thing. Oh, look. I don't know what's happening, but it's brilliant. Look at that one. That one's stuck right up under her face. I'm doing that. <laughs> oh, no. Wait a minute. Oh, you! Get back here! Alright, get back. I want to kill that guy. Where is it? That's not my character. Hell no. Oh, run, guy. Run and get to the main mage guy. Oh, come on. This game's too hard. I'm going to get him next time. Hang about. Ah. Uh, I hope it has saved at some point. Come this way. Let us flee. I'm doing it again. I'm getting to the mage. Come on, quick step guy. Get get through. Oh fucking hell. <laughs> and, <laughs> give it a second, I'm getting him. I've got this. time I just need to be more ready more ready and prepared ah I am I'm ready Come this 
Let us flee. I'm already. I'm climbing. I'm up. Knife. No, oh fuck. They're so stabby. What else have I got? Swift step. Aha. Aha. Oh no. Go on, guy. You're all right. You're not dead. You're fine. Oh, he's dead. FTW, how's it going? One more try. One more try. Rest first, you get your health back. Well, that might be true, Slim Pickens, but I don't think I've got time for rest right now. Come this way. Let us flee. We're fleeing, we're fleeing. We're not fleeing at all. Fucking tricks. <gasps> oh, no. <laughs> oh, you can't kill him for all that. Fine. Whoop. Whoop. No use okay, we don't need the health. That's fine. Oh, yeah, rest at my last inn, but I've not been to an inn. Don't jump. It's not. No. The brine. Run or whatever it was. It's not even my first time. Okay. Why why do you keep saying that, Tony? The cutscenes look good. Back, where did we go? Episode 13. Very confusing. Did things stop working? Window maker. Tony loves window maker. It didn't say two, did it, Tony? Massive spoilers. I'm playing the wrong one. I figured it was much cheaper to just slightly mod the original Dragon's Dogma. And I get to loot this bird as well. Griffin. Tony, your pawn will be so far behind. If you don't play the game immediately, no one's going to hire your pawn. You're not going to go on adventures. You'll have the advantage of being able to hire other people that are more helpful because they have been on adventures, but... You've got no teeth. Oi! Are you all right? 
right? What happened here? I don't think you can play it without pawn stoning it. It's not like using your dog on remnant. A griffin appears one moment and falls the next. And now you stand before me. Yes, that's true. I am the griffin. Was it you then? The one who was riding on its back? Why did they forget to just like animate this one character's face? It is a wonder you survived. Accompany me to the stronghold. We'll treat your wounds and hear your story. Right, it's the ultramarine waterfall. No, I'm not allowed in. Uh oh. Yeah, it's not good motion blur. Keeping it. That's quite nasty. Anyway, I've got a map. I've got controls. I can sheath and draw. Oh, can I kill whoever I want? Can I kill this guy? I don't want to kill this guy. He seems nice. Yeah, so carve and twin fangs. Those are my abilities. I can jump. I can jump. Oh, I can jump and swish. Oh, that's the move. That's like a Tony jar with daggers. Sheath. The character's amazing eradication. I don't I can't help you with that. I have treasure. Where exactly is this jail you say you escaped from anyway? I didn't tell you I escaped from jail. I'm not an idiot. Why would I tell you that straight away? It's certainly not like that here in Burm. Could it be you were held in the neighboring country of Batal? Nay. I suppose that's unlikely. You've been estranged from Batal. Where are you going? I'll uh -huh. Tread carefully by the water's edge, the brine lurking deep waters, rivers, lakes, and the sea, and will instantly consume anyone or thing that wades into their midst. If this fate befalls the arisen, they will be revived momentarily, but they are the exception. No, they will be revived momentarily. Not they'll be like momentarily revived and then they'll die again. Pawns will become forfeit, and all other living creatures are met with an immediate watery death. Good to know. Debilitations are negative statuses with effects that range from inflicting damage at steady intervals to making the target vulnerable to a specific type of attack. Okay. They're not exclusive to rhythm of their pawns, but can be inflicted upon enemies as well. Consult some stuff. Um, yeah. I think I escaped the guard at least. Oh, he waited for me. Come here, guy. Come here, guy. Why can't I grab him? Ah. Fine. Goblins. Let's take up your weapon, sir. You get him. Get him, fella. He's got him. <laughs> Teamwork. Or. Oh. Yeah. Why? Right. Yeah. <laughs> For the break. Oh no! He plucked me out of midair. He's amazing. You stop teaching me. I'm clearly an expert. Oh. Items to be scavenged from the bodies of monsters and their ilk. If you're not squeamish about picking at their bones, that is. Pick them up. Not a bad idea, eradication. But I had other ideas. Have you beheld the dragon as yet? I'm not, and I count that a blessing. All I know for sure is that 'tis a beast e'er more fearsome than a griffin. One need only look to the miserable state of the village of Mel to see that. We can but hope that the sovereign will rid us of it ere long. Obviously tempted to throw this guy in the water. 
I think I'm not going to at the moment. Because he is teaching me how to play the game. It worked last time. Do it! <laughs> uh, why is this guy... Yeah, stab him in the back. Get him, guy. No, they're doing the same to you. Oh, you idiot. run anymore it's a freaking massive homing leap i'm dead i'm, de I'm dead <laughs> he deserved that that was impressive okay game is running fine so far games but i haven't got to any of the bits yet wait for it guy this is Oh, I've got a goblin. I don't want the goblin. I want to pick that guy up. Here we go. Let's get out of here. It's experiment time. Come on. We're going together. It'll be nice. Piss off, goblins. They got the goblin as well. There's a lot of a lot of brain in there. <laughs> Is he gone? Has he gone forever? Oi, I've not even stood up. Don't <laughs> kick me while I'm on the ground. <laughs> okay, okay, I can't. It's too much fun. I need to I need to get on with it. I need to get on with it. Stop doing this. Start playing yourself once you're done with work. FTW. Yeah, it, I mean, I like it so far a lot. Wow. Oh, they threw stones at me again. Where's my stamina? Is it the yellow bar? It must be. Oh, they pluck me out of the air like fucking amazing combatants for the start of the game. Oh, yeah. Where am I going? I'm out. Wow. They don't function so well once you've double knived them in the brain. Level two. What do I do with it? More health, more stamina, strength, magic, and defense. How do I eat my apple? That's got to give me all the health I need. Shut up, guy. I bloody well can. You, on the other hand, just... Totally ruin your chances of survival. Don't need this guy. Seems to think he's in charge. Oh no, <laughs> I ran out of stamina. Wait there, guy, have a little rest. We're getting back. No, <laughs> come back, dickhead. Accept your fate. Ugh. Nobody likes you anyway. Ah. He's fine. I didn't think he was one of the ones that comes back. I thought he was just a guy. I, I To be honest, I'm relieved because I was feeling a little bit guilty about the murder. How am I feeling about it, Gamzee? So far, it's my favourite thing for ages. I'll not force you to receive treatment, but I'd at least like a word. Man. Whose eggs are they? I can kill them. I can't kill them. They're, they're too difficult. Okay, it's just me. Why is there an aged fish in the egg? Morbotoad eats them. It's fine. Ah. Oh, yeah. Okay. He is being a jerk. He keeps telling me what I can and can't do. Uh, 
Tutorial logbook. Hmm. Uh, sit there for a second. <laughs> You're not in charge. He was about to announce our arrival like he's in charge, but no. Welcome, Arisen. We pawns have long awaited your arrival. Thank you. What is this? The pawns. They bend the knee to you so readily, but then... No. Surely you cannot be the Arisen. You seek the Riftstone, do you not? We can take you to it. Pray. Come this way. Proper respect. That's more like it. Before you stands a Riftstone. Tis a gate by which we of the Pawn Legion may cross o'er into this world. Pray. Summon your pawn. Simply paint with your mind's eye the loyal attendant whom you would have serve you. Yeah, here we go, it's happening. In comes Chadley. Hmm. His eyes were the wrong colour, though. I need to hang on. One little thing that I did slightly wrong. Because his eyes are actually... I played Final Fantasy again yesterday. This isn't like a good Chadley. I've not done well or anything, but... Um, but his eyes were definitely more blue than, than white. That should be perfect. My reason... I hate Chadley. So... What I'm doing here is I'm hoping that if Chadley plays well, I start to feel a little differently and start to like the character. And then when I return to Final Fantasy VII Rebirth, I'll be less annoyed by everything he says and does. Doesn't look that much like him, but I'm not good at character creators. Pawns are oft called nomads, for we wander between this world and the many other realms with which we are connected. Good, Chadley, good. I am no exception, and my experiences in these other worlds will doubtless be of aid to you on your adventure. Tis my privilege to accompany you as your loyal pawn. I haven't and started Red Dead Redemption 2, Tony. I gain to guide you. But I will. Well, I'll be... A pawn summoning before my very eyes. And it was. We are the Arisen, then. Strange. I thought the Arisen was in the capital. Surely there's only meant to be one Arisen. Fie, this is all beyond my ken. Mm. Watchhead would know what to do, I'm sure. Though, as luck would have it, he's away. I suppose we'll save any further questions till the Watchhead returns. You're free to do as you like afore then. Of course I am. You can't stop me. Look at me. I'm too intimidating. What? You've no memories, you say? Mayhap you could make for Mel, then. It was set upon by the dragon not long ago. The Arisen is said to bear some deep connection to the dragon. Should you be Arisen, mayhap you'll recall aught of importance. Stop saying mayhap and ought. I want to start saying ought, actually. It seems quite a useful word. Right. So, wrist stones. By touching a wrist stone, the Arisen can travel... To the bridge atwixt worlds. That's also a word I want to introduce. 
which a great many pawns traverse as they journey beyond the rift. This allows the Arisen to summon pawns who meet their specified preferences. These pawns will not level up while they are accompanying you. I thought they do. So you may need to find new ones at regular intervals. Okay, I, okay, but I thought that's what they do. Hail, Arisen. Pray, ask all you wish to know. I shall answer, if it is within my power to do so. Um. Sure, I'll ask questions. Nomads, we are oft called. Born in other worlds, we travel here by means of the rift stone that we might aid you, Arisen. Yeah, but um, other people can hire my pawn, right, Patrick? Like, I thought when they go off on adventures, they not get like ridiculously overpowered or anything, but I thought they still make some sort of progress. However, I cannot speak as to our true nature, for I know of it not. He's irredeemable for a reason, Dave Mac. We merely do as we are commanded. Rift stones are gates that connect this world to a multitude of others. Okay, By good. their power have we crossed into this world. And when our mission is done, by their power shall we return to our own. Good. Tis the name given to fate's chosen. Those destined to command the Pawn Legion and safeguard the world from the threat of the dragon. I like it, Patrick. I like it. Even with your memories lost to you, I am afraid you cannot escape your fate. Can they be in two places at once? Could I hire a pawn that's currently playing alongside their owner? Very well. May fortune speed you on your way, Arisen. Yes. Shut up. Oh, I did hold it. Shut up. Aha. So how do I get... Friends pawns. Type race inclination, weapon skill, specialization and quest. Pawn badge username. I don't want these. I want um this to be populated by people on my Steam's friend list. My Steam friend list. So how does that work? I just assumed that I could pick all of you. There is a search function. Why can't I see the search function? What do I press? Not that. I've only got dash and jump as my functions at the moment. Oh, I guess I should view a tutorial. Map, Brian, dashing and stamina, reloading the game, gathering and combining stuff. Locations, items, shops, pawns, pawn inclinations. There are four types of pawn inclinations. When you enter, mm, what? <laughs> the word's too funny, I can't help it. You'd be able to select an inclination for them. This will determine certain aspects of their behavior, including their manner of speech, the actions they tend to take. However, all pawns serve the arisen faithfully, regardless of their inclination. Okay. Kind-hearted, calm, simple, straightforward. I don't, I don't want to read that. That's fine. That's fine. I don't need another pawn. I've got Chadley. I've got me. Oh, when you try and leave, search for a pawn comes up. Advanced favorited friends pawns. Here we go. Who's not friends with me on Steam? Why not? And where do I see their owner? Type race weapon specialization badge username. Connor. I'm taking Connor's archer with me. I'm playing for the rest of the night. Okay. Did I do it? Is she on my team now? I am attentive and loyal and prefer to remain by your side. In battle, I shall follow your lead and prioritize support. 
Okay, good stuff. Connor, I've stolen your pawn. It's mine now. The favourites. I obviously don't have enough people as friends on Steam, so if you play Steam and you're in our Discord and you haven't added me yet, how dare you not have me added? Why are you free? Pawn quests. Pawn quests are marked. Uh, the task given to your main pawn to be completed beyond the rift. You set the task and must stipulate a reward for the arisen who hires your main pawn to receive upon the task completion. Pawn quests provide valuable opportunities for you to obtain items and acquire pawn badges. So you should endeavour to get your pawn hired as often as possible. That's cool as fuck. I've got nothing to reward anyone with, but when setting a reward for the arisen who hires your main pawn to receive, you can either select specific items or nominate a sum of gold. That's cool as fuck. I know the first game did all this stuff, but it's really a neat little system. I'm not doing that right now. I just want to go. I want to leave now. There is an Asmon gold pawn if you want him. No, I don't want any influencer kind of ones. Um... I want to hire the ones that you lot have made from the from the community. So, add me to the damn friends list. And yes, there is a fair chance that your pawn will get thrown to the Brian. Yeah, on multiple occasions. So, if they come back into your game and they just generally act far more afeard of everything, then you'll know that I've been playing with them. Now, where am I going this way? Shall we see if we can't make our way over to it? Oh hell, Patrick's. Not oh, Patrick. Patrick's fine. Chadley is already irritating. Where is it, Chadley? Show me the damn chest. Shall we see if we can make our way over to it? Yes. Where is it? Oh. Thanks. Why is give gift on the X button? You don't get a gift. Give me, <laughs> hell yeah, one Wanderer's Hood. Purchase, equip. Uh, what else is there? I'm looking pretty ready for a swim. Can I equip stuff onto other people's pawns? Why am I? What? Am I not allowed the hood? Like the mask as well. That would have been a good option. Possibly a better option than what I've gone for. But nice no, swimming hat it is. Look at that face. You can't cover that up. And some pilgrims tights. Why can't I have them? I want them. What? Everything's just out of reach. I like this game. Do I want trousers? Can I buy stuff for Chadley? Oh shit, I can. Buy for Chadley. Chadley, I hate you. I hate you so much. Can I have a silly hat? No. Oh, Chadley's not getting the hat right now. Could put equipment on Connor's pawn. I assume that goes away when they go back to your own game, but. Okay. I understand everything that's happening now. It's fine. It's fine. I'll save the money. Always a pleasure. It is 720. 
Easy mode activated. Tony, you can't not... The whole point of the game is to have them. I do so enjoy stocking up on I think. Supplies. We ought to have enough supplies to last us a while now. I quite agree. Going out, okay. Maybe. Sure that's a good idea. Look at me when you're talking to me. Oh, he did. Eventually. You ought at least rest for the evening. There should be a spare bed in the lodgings yonder. That's fine, but there are three of us. Only don't go rushing off before you're ready. Take it from me. You're better off resting while you have the chance. Okay, making for the lodging. The test is on the map. It's in here. Ugh. Hell yeah. Don't know who it belongs to, but it's mine now. Weight carrier. The total weight of the items you're carrying affects your movement speed. The heavier your pack, the slower your movement and the more stamina you'll expend. Remain light and on your remain light on your feet by sharing your burden with your pawns, disposing items in storage and in, or selling off anything that you don't need. That's perfect. Trying to carry too much at once will cause you to become over encumbered. In this state, you are unable to dash or jump, and you may need to discard items or give up some things to your pawns. Yeah, so that bit's normal. Lots of games have over encumbered. But like a regular granular scale of being too heavy, that's cool as fuck. We ought to put it to good use. <laughs> yes, when you see a ladder, you should definitely put it to good use. No, shut up, we're going to sleep. <laughs> oh what? Recommended that you rest it is. So auto saved data cannot be relied upon to save your progress in this world. Good. Sit down. Um. Good. Good. Where am I sleeping then? Boy there, you seem well tired. Tell you what, you can stay here tonight free of charge. I'll expect coin from tomorrow, mind. Then he doesn't go to that. Yeah, I don't think he can. Your pawn's with me now, Connor. She says she prefers me. I'm a better arisen. More powerful. More likely to succeed. Not a good night's sleep can't fix. Better jokes. There's not much else I can offer, I'm afraid, but you'll find all sorts at a finer inn. Okay. Bye. Being armed is better than being defenseless, even if you're untrained. Still, it is worth devoting yourself to a vocation if you can. Opens up new doors, it does. Yeah. You should stop by the inn in Melv if you get the chance. No hard feelings if you prefer it. They've much more to offer. Okay, I'll do that. Resting at inns fully restores your party's health and stamina. It also recovers the loss gate. What's that? Which represents a reduction in your health and accumulates when taking damage. Oh, very nice. When resting and in, you can choose whether to rise in the morning or at night. Oh, please tell me they are still going to make another, like a Dragon's Dogma online that uses some of these mechanics. They need to, surely. We must rest. Though the sun is still up. Okay. A moment long awaited. I knew it was only a matter of time before your skills reached a new height. There's no discipline that steadfast devotion cannot teach. Yes. You called? Forgive me, but you do not appear to be in need of aid. <laughs> Yeah, he's ignoring me. Where should your pack go oh. over full? Have no fear. I'll lighten your load by spreading it out among us pawns. Okay, who are you? A logistician. A straightforward logistician made by Capcom. You're my favourite. Come with me. Please dispense with the formalities. They exhaust me so. Okay. 
Specializations are skills that can only be acquired by pawns. They are not strictly beneficial, but they allow the pawn to act independently, and this can result in unexpected consequences. Yes! However, with a little patience, planning, and due care, specializations can prove very useful and are well worth trying out. I love unintended consequences. They're my favorite feature of a game. If you would like your pawn to learn a specialization, you would do well to befriend people with various traits and tendencies in the world around you. Sooner or later, these friendships are bound to create opportunities for your pawn to acquire a specialization. Pawn can only acquire one at a time, and learning a new specialization will replace the old one. Consult the specializations entry for more information about its effects. Okay. Still, I can hardly believe it. A griffin of all things here. Add to that the recent dragon sighting. I'm Patrick, same as my name everywhere. Game on Space Acer. Portends an age of peace, yet only trouble has followed. What does it all mean? I had thought being in the border watch would make for easy work, but the wind's beginning to blow in a fell direction. Mm, sorry, that's probably my fault. Um, I'll move on. A material. We have found a material. It was mostly I found the material, but sure. Pawns are going to keep bothering me to hire them. That's okay there. <gasps> I can't do it. You're fine. Have a nice day. I'll carefully conserve my strength and endeavor to survive every battle by way of sound strategy and defense. Who's that? I'm trying to climb a ladder. What are you doing? I've got... I've got pawns. You can be one of my favourites. But also, go away. Four is the maximum team, I assume. My character is disturbing, yes. And heroic. And lost. Uh, why is that an exclamation mark? Am I supposed to talk to the guy out there? I don't want to. I have to. Jump that ladder. Go, Morbo Toad. If your plane had arisen in search of preferable treatment, you'll be sorry. Your head is like to roll ear long. <laughs> he was rude. See ya. How are you going to get down from there, eh, dickhead? I'd hasten home were this not my duty. Yeah, not got anything to say anymore, eh? 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 Yeah, I didn't think so. Kind of did think so. I thought there might be some consequences for that, but I'll take it. Hey, oh. You a soldier? It would be a surprise to see you arrive in one piece if not. Hordes of monsters have been plaguing this area of late, you see. Good. We've had to start sending out new recruits to cull them. Is that so? Who went yonder? Ow. But I dare say he'll fare all right. Aye, I expect he will. Who was sent out that way, then? Accardo. To be honest, sir, I'm a little worried for him. What? Weren't harpies reported in that area? I can't handle those beasts on his own. This is the first I'm hearing of it. Fine. I want to go to his aid, but we can't just abandon our posts. Okay. Say, you seem stout of heart. Would you be willing to go in our stead? It isn't far. Only a short ways out from the main gate. He seems stout of heart, don't I? I do. You've my thanks. Anacardos as well, I'm sure. That's going to be helpful whenever I need my groceries delivered. Um, 
You can select a quest to prioritize from among those that you've accepted. If the quest destination is known, a marker will be placed on your map to indicate it. Furthermore, if you have a pawn in your party who possesses knowledge of that particular quest, they'll be able to guide you to your objective. However, pawns with such knowledge will not offer guidance unless the quest is set as a priority. A warning regarding quest progression. Some quests are affected by the passage of time and will progress even without the Arisen's involvement. Taking on multiple quests at once comes with the risk of being unable to act in time, and this can result in unintended consequences. Try to bear the factor of time in mind when managing your current quests and taking on new ones. Fly to the aid of those in need. Flying. Set as priority quest. Dodge using mage pawn. My, my Chadley is a mage as well. Because the magic looks cool as fuck in these games, but also slow. I want it to be a bit more nimble. So I let somebody else take care of the magic. It's... ah. Uh, I was mid-attack, damn you. There are four commands that the Arisen can use to direct their pawn companions, and their effects vary according to the circumstances in which they use, such as when in or out of combat. Best way to get a feel for each command is to observe your pawn's response, and of course action in various situations. Go instruction to act independently of the Arisen. During combat, it directs pawns to spread out across the battlefield. It can also be used to request assistance with carrying out an action, to request guidance to a location, or to instruct a pawn to resume guidance. Okay. To me, makes them approach. Wait, makes them wait. Help makes them heal and recover. No, stay at the ground because that's stupid. We're an amazing team. Mostly me. Goblins on fire, Chuck. Mm, that's fine. Loot, loot, loot. Uh, you must make sure they are dead. No, not like that. No mercy, no mercy is right. Stab them in the knees. Okay. Who are they fighting? Oh. Just your We've got goblins. We have no means of exploiting our enemies' weakness. <laughs> Terrible. So it doesn't like aim the throwing for you. Ah, uh, what are you doing, Chadley? They're miles away. You look like an idiot. As do I. It would have been good if any of those had landed, though. Guys, calm down. <laughs> ah. Got me some beast gear and Chadley leveled up. Um, I'm going the wrong way. This guy might die if I go the wrong way. It's yours, Patrick. Yeah, I didn't get Patrick's. We're friends now, though, right? Have you forgotten something arisen? You're looking rather lost. Are there any more up here? I want them. Got some copper ore, that's brilliant. Got a boulder. Ah. Oh. Yeah, I've got him. Oh, he's dead. Ah. Oh. Okay. What else have we got? So there's stuff over there. We trounced our foe well and true. Shut up, Chadley. Fucking Chadley. Take each trial as it comes. Enjoying the game so far, bro I, I really am, very much. 
Look at this shit. That's okay. I'm off. No! Don't... You shot him down. That was fine. I was quite content. Who are you? Did you come to aid me? No. I'm taking a harpy home. Joke's on them. They thought they were taking me home. But no. This one's mine. All right, shoot it. Ah, oh, Morboto's level four. What do I do with it? Do I get skill points? Or just stats? I love this game, it's so fun. Like the combat's really basic so far. But so fun anyway. Let me get that. Didn't I just finish a quest? Where did he go? Here he is. Is that all of them? I don't what what I really don't like is that you have to press A or B to progress a conversation. I keep just leaving it. And look at that guy's face, he's just stuck. Like when um, when we we're doing the podcast yesterday and Discord kept freezing and people just looked like that guy. Uh. Of my thanks. I do not believe for a moment I could have slain those creatures without your help. I've only just enlisted, and when I thought this could be the end of me, I, I was paralyzed. You saved me this time, but I won't always be so fortunate. I'll have to. Well, Oops. I'd best be heading back, but I'll be sure to let my superiors know of your good deed. I hope we meet again someday. Okay. Do I have to go back for the reward? Rabbit! Oh, come on. Where'd it go? No, oh, I do. I have to go back and turn the quest in myself. I will bring back the evidence. Otherwise, no one's going to believe that story, are they? Like, how would we kill harpies? They fly. You can carry so much stuff to so many stupid places. There's a treasure chest over there. A common reward. Frustratingly so. We cannot expect gleaming treasures around every corner. And I assume, do you reckon, morally, it's reasonable to eat a harpy? Hey, old friend. Many thanks for aiding Ocado. It was a relief to see him return. And none the worse. If it is, Ocado just delivered dinner. Aye, that it was. The poor sod might not have made it back alive had you not intervened. Um, Brock, I've, I've died like 17 times, but none of it has been because the class has been a struggle. So, I don't know. It was a bit too early for him to be seen actual combat. What class are you? Was made well, clear. We'll be extending his training period. The instructors here are well known for whipping recruits into shape with their grueling regimes. <laughs> Speaking of training regimes, I must admit I've half a mind to ask you to join us. We could use someone with your experience. We have succeeded in defending our charge. Why did, what? Things to come, Where did my harpy go? Pleasure to recount such good tidings. Oh no! Fancy a gander? There's a ladder here. We ought to put it to good use. <laughs> What's that with these pawns and their ladders? They're like, oh, it's a ladder. We should definitely climb it. No, why would I just climb a ladder every time I see it? That's a stupid idea. So the Faith can do little dashes. I assume when you press that button, it's the right bumper. Um, this will seem of little consequence, on a fighter, I assume they guard. Their party at the drop of a hat. 
One such arisen dismissed me after only half a day of service. Each to their own. Oh, Chadley, I hate you. It's going to take a little while to get over the Chadley hate. <laughs> Sorry, Fang, I wasn't trying to pick you up. Oh, well, it's happened. Um, get out of the way, I want to talk to this person. I've a knack for gathering items and am ever on the hunt for new finds. I'll gladly try out any useful mechanisms I espy. You do that. Um, fortunately for you, I have a knack for gathering people that have a knack for gathering things. You're coming with me as the fifth born. Why is there a gem on the map? I don't know. I don't care. There were harpies. There were harpies. Past tense. Oh, there's another one. Sneaking. Ah, they saw me coming. Oh, that's different. A flawless execution. Let us try for the same result with our next attack. a good jump no I'm, I, I asked the question Tony but nobody knows about eating harpies and Morbo Toad would struggle because he doesn't have teeth wow ah, my face what Chadley you were on the same team oh, oh, oh I'm gonna die Chadley save me He did too. Vocation rank up. Oh, what does that mean? I'm a better thief now. I get that. Pleased to make your acquaintance. Good. I, I don't want to hire you. <laughs> Capcom's pawns are everywhere. But you've got a quest to defeat a Cyclops. Right, you're on the team. Um, sorry, Daniela, you are out. You can send them away with a gift. No. No, why would I... You can have a rotten shorefish. Choose a rating. No. Whatever else might be said of me, know that I served you with all I had. Okay, good job. Oh, good. I see the Arisen's found someone to handle our busy work. How do I do your quest? Not much to say at the moment. Okay, how do I do your quest? If you seek to restore your memories, Master, me thinks a trip to Melv might be just the thing. Or, me thinks you've got a quest about a Cyclops. Let's talk about that. Follow me. Follow you. There's one quest. Quest list in the Dragon's Wake. Do you have a quest or not, you fuck? I missed my other one. Where's she gone? I want her back. Come back. The big cat things let me down big time. Alas, we must part ways for the time being. No, nope, you're alright. I know that I look forward to travelling with you again in future. You're back on to uh, actually. No, you're not. See you later. We'll keep we'll keep the big cat thing. Cancel. 
Photon is a, a weird name for a cat thief warrior, but I want a fighter, I think, just to like get one of each and that, you know, proper rounded party. In the meantime, I just want to explore and find more harpies to eat. Definitely going the wrong way, doesn't matter. Proton wants to go that way. Photon, photon, proton, whatever. I'm going to leave Connor's pawn dead in a ditch somewhere. Sneak, sneak, sneak. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. The battle continues. Thank you. Never have I encountered such a strategy. Now that is a surprise. This is fun. I like this game. I don't know how long this basic stuff will, will remain fun. Like how long is it's okay for me to just be silly and not progress through the story. I think I probably need to. I'm going to. I could make a camp, but I don't want to. Um, who said that? Was it you? Following. Take me to the Cyclops. Oh, you're taking me to the main quest. Any good? Pete, it's brilliant. Any problems? Not not really, no. I haven't been to the busy areas yet, but... No matter. I shall... Hang in there, Master. I'm coming to assist. Thank you. Honor's pawn just gave me an invigorating pat on the back so that I could continue sprinting. And I wasted it to go and pick up some green warish. Peep. You're not able to be here early. You're out. Oh, I accidentally got to Melv. Stronghold. Burnt up by Dragon's Fire. Skillfully dodge the words you're not sure about. Tis a sorry sight indeed. The dragon truly is calamity incarnate. I want to get rid of everything I'm carrying. Oh. Yep, this one's just randomly sat on the ground. Okay. Chadley, I don't trust anybody else to carry my stuff. I'll carefully conserve my strength and endeavor to survive every battle by way of sound strategy and defensive tactics. I bet you will. So, this is Melv. The scars left by the oh, dragons. Tony, I'll catch you later. See, of course again, I've replied to everything you've said so far. And here I thought I was leading. Oh, something's happening. <laughs> what are you doing, you idiot?
That's not real work. And you're not getting paid. Busted. Yes, Pete, thank you. It's the Morbo Toad. That is most unfortunate. But it doth not release thee from thy fate. Ah, oh, indigestion. The end. Nope. Something about this seems unreasonable. I can't carry that, can I? You fall back, I'm way freaking brave. Oh, oh, oh. Hiya! I've got it, I've got it, I've got it! Hiya! It's nearly dead, it's nearly dead. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up! Oh shit. Oh no. I've got. Presumably. Where am I? Oh good, I thought I got in its butt by accident. I don't know what's happening, but it's like. I like it. Stab it! Keep climbing, guy. Keep climbing. Oh, I didn't need to hold it down. Oh, I'm going to stab a dragon in the brain. My stamina's running out, so I'm going to stab it here for now. I did it. Dragon's dead. Don't eat her, she was nice to me. face, my beautiful face. No, my... It's fine, it's still beating. I'm still good. Okay, I know what I need to do. That cutscene was in Dogma 1. This is supposed to be kind of a... Almost a, re a remake, but avoiding the scary name of a remake. Can you hear me, sir? Sir, stay with me. So... My new mission is to eat the dragon's heart. And then we're even. Maybe burn its face a little bit. I don't understand. Was that supposed to be in the past? Because I don't have a shield or armor like that. Uh, 
That's you can tell from that look she loves me. How are you feeling? Oh, I got a breast of buttons. Is it? You do not remember? Then have you forgotten that you protected me from the dragon's flames? You withstood the fire in my stead and were well and truly charred. It was terrible. I had thought your life forfeit. I could not hear the beating of your heart. You hung on and by some miracle survived. She has to be really careful delivering sentences with pauses because if they pause for too long, I press the next button and skip the line. I seem to have become arisen. Arisen? I'm afraid I don't understand your meaning. Ah, uh, look, look at her face. Surprise forever. Is it ever going to end? No, because I'm going to pause and answer Flush's questions. Flush, the story of the microtransactions. <laughs> He's so surprised. Is that there are a bunch. I've not seen any evidence of them. Like There was a store on the title screen. And if you go onto Steam, it will list all the things that you can buy. But I've not really looked into what they are. And I've not seen anything in the game that has pushed me towards them. But... They exist, which is a, a, a lame little touch. Apparently, um, so people say that they were like Capcom were bad because they didn't tell people beforehand or whatever, which is untrue because apparently it was fairly clearly listed in the the review guidance that comes with uh, with the key. So anyone that had played it in advance and was reviewing it should have been able to tell you that there were microtransactions if they had read the material that came with it. But it seems very few people did, so it was portrayed as deceiving um they're there though and I, I don't like microtransactions that shouldn't be a secret at this point as i've complained many many times microtransactions like there's one in this that lets you do fast travel fast travel is very restrictive and you can't very often do it in this game supposedly unless you buy whatever the item is that lets you fast travel and that is lame i'm going to ignore them i'm going to pretend they don't exist and play the game without them um, but that particular, that fast travel example is, is weird because the guy that made the game, the like, lead producer, or whatever it's called, specifically talked about how fast travel is deliberately not very often available because that's part of the world, the world building. They want you to explore by foot. They want it to be difficult. Then they go and sell it. So who knows? She's still so surprised. As for bugs and things, I've not really had anything noteworthy yet. No crashes. Nothing really go wrong. One guy was a little bit glitched on a stair. But... Right, I'm going to set her free from her state of stupor. Does it have aught to do with why you were taken to the castle? They say aught a lot. They said it was so that your wounds could be treated. Though I fear you have no memory of this either. Has he come for you? Are you aught of this? We are to part so soon then. Why? Mayhap you will visit me again someday. Mayhap. Well, then. Take care. Arisen. Yeah, so, um. Yes, Patrick, there's fast traveling game, but you need a particular item for it, right? And they've. Ah, excellent. You must be the one. You match my soldier's description. Like it's supposed to be enough that you don't overly use it to just dot around everywhere willy nilly. Like Horizon has um, fast travel, but you need to buy the ration packs for it. Whereas Final Fantasy VII Rebirth has unlimited fast travel, and you do absolutely abuse it and fast travel everywhere. Which is what they were trying to avoid in theory. But... The ruler of Vermin currently convalescing in the capital became arisen here in this very village if you claim the same then word must be borne to the capital i dispatched a missive before coming here though i doubt the matter can be settled without your presence would you be willing to accompany me to the capital if 
you truly are arisen, you will be received with open arms. I am going to go with that guy and get some kind of hugs, apparently. Forgive me. I scattered my soldiers in a bid to find you. I would not depart without them. We shall have to wait till they are reassembled. Come to think of it, Sir Leonard was asking after you as well. Mayhap now would be a good time to speak with him. Mayhap. Last I saw, he was having a drink at the inn. Shall we seek some answers? Ah. Uh. Enter the Venwer. Set as priority quest. Do you think this one's really a risk? I have decided I would like to buy some kind of trousers. So where am I now? Ah, no, Melf was burnt down. Wasn't it? I think it's a reasonably clean wall. Stop cleaning the wall. If you want my advice, heed no advice, save your own. Um, There's a ladder here. Ah, excellent find. Excellent find. It's a ladder. We must climb it. Always climb the ladder. So microtransactions let you buy an additional fast travel point. That's weird. Here, yes, useful ingredient. To be found while we're here. We shall see if there's ought to be found. Mayhaps there will be something atwixt the floors of the tower. I got a fluted bow. Oh, and I traversed the stairs with massive style and grace. For no reason. Hmm. Yeah! <laughs> oh, I like it. Good game, good game. Okay, do I have to go and get the bow again? That was like a record set in Abbey Splat. I can't not do that. I don't know why. Yeah, we're gonna do that. I know just where to find this person. Follow me. I don't like Photon. She's leaving the team as soon as I find someone else. Now we shan't lose our way. Where did the bow go? I need to pick it up again. I don't even use a bow, but Okay. Tis views such as this that make a journey worthwhile. We are alone here, methinks. Perhaps we might stop a moment and find our bearings. It's no great shock to me. Man. Right. Yeah, no, I, I'm very much liking the game so far. Could get a different player spot. Oh, I'm friends with Patrick now, am I? Let's see if that works. Uh, uh, Shadowheart, Tessie, Ragnar. Search for a pawn. Friends pawns. Oh, Patrick, are we friends? Wait, there. Oh, I'm going to need to do it afterwards. I can't. Can't risk getting onto Steam right now. We'll do that later. Baz, how's it going? Yours is a mage. I'd have two mages, they're fine. But I have to find your friend request on Steam and all that, so I'll have to do it afterwards. Yeah. 
Damn. So next time, because mages like are cool and they do magic stuff. I assume later when the classes expand, then. Well, you can throw potions at people. That sounds fun. Ah, uh, wrong building, wrong building. Now people are talking to each other. Feels a little more alive. You surrender, guy. Surrender. He did. Well, Matt, you're the one who saved Ulrika's life, aren't you? Yeah. She told me all sure. about it. It was a very brave thing you did. I'm in your debt. Ulrika's as good as my daughter. Here, consider this a small token of my gratitude. This reward for a quest I didn't even do. You registered with a guild. Hmm. Perhaps you already know this, but registering with a guild will grant you access to specialized training, which comes in very useful when pursuing a vacation. Hell yes, let me do it. Well, now, that won't do. You need only speak with the innkeeper to register. Go on, it will only take a moment. If there is aught you wish to know of vacations, mayhap I can advise you. Aught mayhap you can. It is a vacation for those who seek to master the dagger. Such blades lack heft, though this grants them the advantage of speed. Yes. Thieves favor light armor, which leaves them more vulnerable to attacks than those of other vacations. Their talents depend upon their finesse and ability to compensate for the length of their blade through sheer agility. That sounds like me. Should you dedicate yourself to a vocation, you will find that new paths to master will open up to you over time. Try them as you like. Hey, so I can switch whenever I want. I how does it work? Does anyone know? If I were to switch from like a thief to a mage, would I reset to level one? Or would I be a level five mage and all my stats would shift? Or would I be a level five mage that's got the wrong stats because I trained as a thief? As you're good, you have a good a look to see what it's like. You can't believe they're charging if you want to make a new character. That's for additional pawns, right? It's weird because when you use the um the character creator that they released before the game came, you can make five pawns. So I'm not sure where the charging comes in and all of that kind of stuff. Uh it is a vacation for those who seek to master the sword and shield. Fighters favor a balanced approach. Excelling in both offense and defense, and can adapt to any situation. <laughs> I am a fighter myself, and should there come a time when you impress me with your prowess, I might be willing to impart unto you some of what I know. Very generous. Decline the offer. Very well. There is no wrong choice in any case. It is entirely up to you which vocation you adopt. But I shan't take up any more of your time. Pray be well. Thanks. The Meister's Teaching. The Meister's Teaching is the most powerful skill that can be acquired by each vocation. Learning a Meister's Teaching requires the use of a special tone which you will receive if you impress the vocation Meister with your abilities. However, the true potential of this skill can only be realized by those whose vocation rank is high enough. The inn, we also offer changes of vocation for those who seek it. Okay. I get so few customers, you see, that I can manage both roles myself. I'm going to give you... A... Strawberry's a bit romantic. Um, variety of tuber known to grow far and wide, consume to recover a small amount of stamina. I'm never going to consume fake potatoes in the middle of a battle to recover stamina, so you can have potato. What's this now? Just eat it, you'll feel better. 
here at the inn, we also offer changes of vocation for those who seek it. I get so few customers, you see, that I can manage both roles myself. But enough about me. Did you need something? Yeah, I want you to say thank you. I gave you a potato. Resting for 1,500. What the hell? Fine, you can look after. Arch is more fun. No, I'm staying as a thief for the time being. You can look after my... Got a fuel lantern, that's nice. You can look after my branches. All of them. And also my potato, as you don't want them. That's it. That's all you can have. I hang about, I can equip, I can acquire skills here. All manner of vocational procedures can be carried out in the guild hall of a vocation guild. Changing vocation, if you've unlocked a vocation, you can change to it any time. Unlocking new vocations requires discipline, which is accrued when defeating enemies and completing quests, of course. Each vocation trains different skills, and you'll be able to learn new skills as your rank within your vocation rises. Learning skills requires discipline. Core skills can be employed from the moment they are acquired, but weapon skills must be equipped before they can be used. Augments. These are special abilities that can be equipped regardless of your current vocation. Augments are acquired by spending discipline and are active from the moment they are equipped. You can equip up to six augments at once. A broader variety of augments will become available as your vocation rank increases. Okay. Good, I like it. So I can inquire, inquire, acquire, and kindle blaze. So bring the daggers together to ignite them, wreathing them in flame for a short time. And you can do it while you're clinging or pinning down a foe. That's fun. I like it. Shadow cloak. Get, the, get out of here. I'm not a dickhead. Helm split. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. Helm splitter. They could definitely have demonstrated this skill in the little window there by using a soldier with a helmet rather than the implication here where you attack the groin of a giant ogre. Because, you know, helm and helm. I, I'm shocked that they've chosen to go for the, for the ogre groin rather than a soldier's helm. But okay, leap up and dive through the air while spinning. Blaze extended. I want that. How much discipline have I got? 700. And I want that. I could explode shit. Acquire, yes. And... So exploding shit is going to go on. Dashes past the target with blaze extended. Um. Okay, good. So X is my charge. B is going to be place grenade explosive. A is going to be Helm Splitter. I can't afford the Fire Blades yet. No, Y is going to be Helm Splitter. Ah! Y is Helm Splitter. Helm Splitter's on both of them. That's nice and easy. Oh no, I spent all of my points on the first tab and didn't get to look at the core skills. Scarlet's Kiss, tapping X repeatedly. Ah, I want that! Controlled fall. Tucks the body into a tight roll when hitting the ground after being knocked down. I want that too. And I want the augments. Subtlety. Ah, fuck that. Subtlety. Get out of here. Or you can spend points to become a handsome mage or an archer. I like this game. I like this game. Carrying on with the thief for the time being. Always a pleasure. Right trigger lets you give stuff to your pawn. What, on that particular screen that we were on there? Because right trigger makes me pick up my pawn. What have I done to this? So 
this is where you've been. Come with me to the village entrance. The watchhead's waiting for you. Okay. Right. Who might have the answers we need? Should we ask around? It's right trigger while I was in there, I assume. That's fine. Okay. So, reappearing on YouTube any moment now, in theory. In theory. I should tell them. Which may also go through elsewhere. No, that's fine. Everything's perfect. Let me bring up my normal... So I can see Twitch chat, though there's nobody there. So, sorry, YouTube people. What you missed was some freaking pristine combat. I did brilliant, amazing, really impressive things while you were staring at a completely still broken screen. You also missed this pawn appeared and said she's really cool. She said, like, oh, I don't like items and shit. I just like fighting things. So I've invited her to the team instead of that photon one. This is a player's pawn, though, like a random player's pawn. No harm in picking a few. But yeah, that's good. And you can see, like, through massive, crazy combat abilities, I killed all of this shit. With stuff like this ability. <laughs> Boom! Didn't, it, it was cool. Stuff went flying everywhere. It was really impressive. It's about time we pressed on, you say, Master? Thank you, Chronic. But confirming it's back. Thank you for telling me that it was frozen in the first place. I wouldn't have noticed. So it has always been. To claim the title is to claim the throne. Yet not all claims are true. Our kingdom sees... That's a harp is. Harp is. And they are not dealt with lightly. Let's hope you're not one of them. Regardless, you will not be like my mistrust. Go on a day. Because now I can go. Come on, come down. Oh, why are my guys just falling asleep? Focus your strength, there is it. Oh, they're all falling asleep. Quick, get up. I'm up. Ah, boom. And I've got icy blades and... Come on. What else did I have? Oh, yeah. Charge. Charge off a cliff if I do, though. Oh no, my buddy. Who fell down? That guy fall he's gone, he's not coming back. Oh and look. So Chadley's put ice sword and shield on my companion as well. This is so damn cool. Harpy's back. Ah. Oh. Not anymore. Oh, but Jezzer has gone and started a fight with the goblins. Wait, I'm putting down an explosive. Don't hit me. And... But... Oh, Jezzer, I'm busy. Job team. Ah, oh, I like this game. button good strong face connor's thing look how strong connor's pawn's face is she's way tough can i pick up the barrel no oh i missed on that one that's all right though okay given lead to rest yet i'm well aware of that thank you ah you can live you can live for the time being 
An obstacle blocks our way. Perhaps we might remove it by force. If a ranged attack is needed, you can count upon my aim. Might I be of assistance? What are you talking about, Chadley? You're pointing at nothing useful. Oh, hello. What's happening? You're also a player's archery pawn. Um, I'm going to keep Connors though, so thank you anyway, but I will leave you. I don't know where she landed, but whatever. She's not one of my friends. Chadley was pointing at this rock like he's got some good plan. Oh, there's some stuff up there. How do I get up? Can you climb rocks? If I just hold the button. You can't like Zelda climb or anything. I want to go up there and see what's going on. Bum, 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 bum. I don't think there is an easy way up there. Climb guy, you can do it. Yeah, stand on her head. He's doing it, he's doing it. Hell yeah. Then what? What do I do now I'm up here? I thought I saw something up here, but I didn't, apparently. Yeah, I did. It was just it was higher. Okay, fine. Mm. 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 Maybe. Maybe I can get up there. Hell yes. No! Go on, guy. You can... Nah, you can do it. Fine. I'll go up the side. It's not... Oh, damn. It's a one-way little slippy bit. Go on, you can get it. Oh, you can do it. You can do it. I reckon you can do it. A little bit of bugged up jumping. We've all been there. Or play games that require a little bit of a glitchy upper wall. Not for like a fair number of years, but let's not pretend we're too good for it, eh? Ah, fine. Not going that way. Can I get in there? Something gonna kill me in here? No. That's the story of how I got completely lost. I think what I should do is use this forgotten rift stone. Don't know what's happening right now. I enjoy tackling fierce foes and prefer combat thrills to gathering items i am confident and may act independently that's the same thing as the other one said and belongs to ganja the troll that is a much higher level and has a quest to defeat the cyclops and will give me five thousand gold that's actually probably worth it okay chili flake you're hired in place of the level five one And you will go with a rotten scrag of beast. And a thumbs up. I see the Arisen's found someone to handle our busy work. Up, oh, just let's go. Follow me then. Unless you doubt my sense of direction. Uh I'm in charge, you follow me. But I do need to yeah, get to a save point now so I can stop. That's the next plan, is to find the next save point. I don't think this game 
is necessarily that generous on saving. Don't know when I can do that. Oh, this is what Chadley can move. Do it. Go on, Chadley. Go on, Chadley. Oh, he's only gone and done it. I made it to the statue. One can see far to the distance. Got some potatoes. Perhaps we might take a moment to savor the scene. No, sharp. We're not taking a moment. Yeah, I'll be right. That tavern, yeah, exactly, but um Oh, should I go back to the previous tavern? No, it's quite a way. There's gotta be another one coming up, right? Obviously on the console I could just like turn it off and hope that it suspended and resumed properly, but PC has no such luxury, so it does have the luxury of sixty frames per second camera spins. Reasonable trade off. Oh. Orders to keep this gate sealed till the watchhead returns. Halt. State your business. We've orders to keep this gate sealed till the watchhead returns. Have you? I've got orders not to sit in a fire. You might want to consider the same. Dickhead. Yeah. Hmm. No one's coming to assail us. Mayhap we've scared them all off? I'll take the peace and quiet over a horde of enemies any day. Someone take this wood and build a bridge across to there. Begging your pardon, sir, but I'm on duty. What do you think you're doing here? Do let me know if you're in need of aid. I am in need of aid. I want to go through through the door checkpoint thing I don't know about you master halt state your business <laughs> we've ordered what this game's too hard I'm stuck now right I'm going back to town I did have a team that I was following and I've lost them Shall we see if there's ought to be found while we're here? You see if there's ought to be found. I'm lost. To a save point. Where did Gregor go? So we did all of this. We killed these guys. Much combat was had. Everybody enjoyed it. Oh, but Toad needs a rest. And I need dinner. You can just click save and continue. Oh, but it told me that I couldn't. It told me that it was unreliable and I should save at the hotels. You really can just press save and continue. Why did the tooltip lie to me? I didn't even mind the hardship of having to go back to a tavern. Right, okay, I'm going back this way then. I will log off in the correct place. Could go down there. Oh, I can cross over there. Okay, fine, I'm doing that. Now that I know I can stop at any moment. Where did the team go? The people that were escorting me have all just, like, left. So I just landed in London, your favourite city. Why is London your favourite city? Um, I'm loving this game so far. Because Connor's 
pawn has a really hard face. Look at that, she don't even care. There can be no harm in bringing this along. We cannot expect gleaming treasures around every corner. Well, your friends from Dublin moved there. Fair enough. It's too busy for me. I'm not a big fan of London, but never been to Dublin. I imagine I would prefer it. You're right, though. It does have, you know, like, it is diverse and interesting. It's just way too busy and. There's a few things about it that I'm less keen on, but mm, do I want to go over here? Yes. Oh, I'll take that. We might find a use for it. Might find a use for your potato. Shut up, idiot! I say as I pick up a potato. And <laughs> more, loads of potatoes. Past buzz is potatoes, right? What do I make of the controversy? Why are people so angry? Games are so trigger happy. Yeah, the game's awesome. Um, it does, like, I'm not a fan of microtransactions and it sucks that they're there. I would rather they weren't. At the same time, it does seem a very complete, playable, not designed around microtransactions game so far. Mm -hmm. I'm not sitting here thinking I would be progressing much faster if I spent a bit of money or any of those kind of shitty things that you can get. first big performance drop but riff thing but I don't need it I'm not going to rest either I'm going to save the game here and go and have dinner wow Connor's pawn's terrible she needs to go Connor play harder so that next time I am normally less forgiving of microtransactions than you are. It's a tricky one though, like the if it doesn't affect your game thing is really difficult to really know for sure if the game was designed around those transactions, if things are slower than they otherwise would be because Capcom insists that it, like they want those transactions to be enticing or whatever. Or if they literally made a game and then added transactions on afterwards where they could see space for them. Because that's fine, like, if they've made a proper game, then cool. But hard to know from the outside. Uh, I just want to have a quick look at the photo mode because I'm curious. Can you use... No, don't like the photo mode. Reset camera guidance, but yeah, photo mode sucks. You feel like they made easy mode into some microtransactions. Well, that kind of thing, like, there's no good side to microtransactions. Other than like potentially mitigating higher prices for games. They never enhance the design or make it better. They never... Like, the best way to cater to people that don't have time is not to charge those people more money. That's absurd. But it is what it is, right? We lost that fight. Microtransactions are everywhere. You think it's easy to tell? Gamers were able to tell when Diablo Immortal released, but Diablo Immortal is a free-to-play game, so of course it was designed around them. But this game, like we're never going to know from the outside if you would be able to fast travel as much as you wanted if those microtransactions didn't exist. Did, did they make that limited because they wanted to sell it? Or did they make that limited because they wanted the game to be a little like, less welcoming? 
and I don't know the answer. Like none of us know the answer. But buying rift crystals lets you high pawns way higher level. Yeah, it's got outright like pay to be stronger and better things in there, which is odd. Anyway, we'll talk about that more. I'm sure over the coming days. For now, that's that's my streaming for today because I need to go and have dinner and I need to sleep pretty soon because I'm up early again for another drastic far away Saturday. Sunday I will be doing the usual community stream so I will be away from this game for a little while we'll do I'm not sure what game to start with followed by Halo Halo is the one that's locked in definitely going to happen so if you've got Halo installed make sure it's updated with the update that came out this week jump in on that because those are always a good time uh, Ty A enjoy London like, if you're seeing your friends then that's awesome good time everybody else have fantastic weekends and I will see you soon mm. blah Game on daily.